Well, how do there, chums? I'm back inside of Power World. Now, somebody hit me up and said, Captain Steve, have you merged your pals? And I'm like, merge pals, you say? Really? It's not something that I was aware I could do. And so anyways, today I'm going to be building out some things. Let's go into pals. I need a pal condenser. I need some ingots. I go to my ingot farm because I ain't got ingots. <laughs> no, I haven't. So I go to my ingot farm. And I'm going to make a load of ingots, and I'll be right back when we can build a PAL condenser. And then we're going to fusionate PALs together and make super rock hard PALs. Yes, I've got a pretty cool party now. This is my party that I'm going to take to destroy the end boss of the game. But yeah, I haven't done any fusion on these. I need to get my war set all the way up to top tier level as well, because um, I think he could do quite a good job. Anyway, I'll be right back with you when I've got my ingots. Okay, Jams, I now have enough for my power condenser. Now, I'm thinking I'm putting this over near to where all my sort of hatcheries are. Maybe... Hmm, I can't put it too close, I guess. I'll have to stick it over here. Why the fudge not? Okay, I don't know whether I have to wire this thing in or something, but let, let's put it here. Can't believe I haven't built one of these before. I had to unlock it using Asian technologies. Had it sitting here for a while and just completely overlooked it, people. Uh, okay, cool. And, and it's quite early game. I could have been doing this miles ago. Fudging could have made it a lot easier for myself. There we go. Power condenser menu. Right, okay. Well, the first one I want to do up is this guy. So let's stick him in there. And I want to then merge every single one of my other blazer moots into this one. So where's all my other blazer moots? Here they are. Let's go with you, 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 and you. Oh my days! It's going to go up quite a significant amount. There we go. Go. That's it. A couple of seconds. All right, we'll do that again. Yeah, we'll put in all the other blazer moves. There we go. Oh, you have to put in sixteen this time. Okay, well there's a boss one there, and we've got that one as well. Um, I'm going for a few other fire types. Just put in a couple of Ragnar hawks. These are only level one. That was level thirty-five. Level one. Is that actually working? Why is it not... Powers use essence will be consumed. Why... I've got all these ones. Why is it... Oh, it looks like I've got to go get a whole load more of them. I mean, I could breed more of them. It looks like you have to put the same type in. So I need a whole load more of them. Okay, alright. Um, we could breed a load, couldn't we? All right, that's probably a good thing that I didn't go and infuse them all. Okay, we're, we're learning on the job, people. All right, okay, well, let's let, let's take out that freaking unicorn guy from there for a second. There we go, so let's go into here. Power box, and we want to take out the unicorn. What, what blazer moot have we got in there right now? That's a female one, so if I take out him, and we stick in a male blazer moot. There we go, blazer moot, male. There's a male. And he's a flame emperor. We'd have him. Let's go grab him. Come here, you. Oi, come here. Freaking, come here. Nah. Got him. Right, let's go stick him in with this female blaze moot. Put blaze moot and blaze moot together. They're bound to make another blaze moot, right? You would have fought anyway. Okay. Okay, uh, I want to put you there. Yeah, there we go. Do your thing. Have we got some cake in here? We have. We've got some cake in there. We've only got three cake. I need to make more cake. I need to make a whole freaking army of blazer moots. All right, here we go. I might as well pick up this huge egg. Hmm. Rocky eggs. Ah, oh, these are these are more of those um insect ones, which is probably a good thing actually, because then uh, I can infuse all of those. I mean, I can do quite a few creatures. Oh look, got loads of eggs to hatch. These are all those insect ones so I could start infusing the insect guy, my war set a fair few times. Okay, that, this one's almost done now. I could change the incubation time on my server just so I can do this super quick. But I think you get the idea, people. Pretty darn nice. But it looks like I've got a whole load of breeding and other shenanigans to do. Cake making... Yeah, I'm going to be quite busy doing this to get all the infusion that I need to get my pals tippity-top shape to take on that end boss. But I think I've got another strategy now, people. 
Well, chums, I am breeding war sects, and I'm also breeding blazer moots, and hopefully I'm going to infuse all of these, get them up to being four star, a blazer moot and a war sect. I'm wondering whether just a blazer moot and a war sect, highest tier possible, is going to take on the boss, just those two powers on their own. And we can only but wait and see, people. Now, something else I didn't realise, you get power souls, and you can go here. I've always just enhanced player stats, um, but I've heard that's broken anyway, so you best just to do enhanced powers. And you can actually enhance your power right here. So here you go, let's um, enhance this. Max health, attack. Yes, we're going to stick on attack, please. Heck yes. Has that, has that enhanced it? Has that enhanced it? Okay, um, I guess that's all I can do for now. No, nope. we can do that one. Enhance. Yes. Do you have to... All my days, this could take ages. Alright, fine. Uh, we go for ha max health as well then. And how many times can I do this? I mean, I've got 20 odd up there, so that's all cool. Right, we're going to keep going on attack. We're going to make my blazer moot freaking lethal and bizzle. I guess we are. Bow. And now we've got to put in purple ones, which I'm doing. Sweet. Bow. And we can even put in the gold. There we are. Boom. And yeah, we've now got my blazer moot pretty darn freaking lethal. Let's um, let's 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 do this as well. Then. Well, that's a little bit tedious. I suppose this is a lot quicker if you're using keyboard and mouse if you're on PC. But you know, it's a bit tedious with the old PlayStation or joypad. I get defense. I'm gonna I'm gonna put some in there as well. Sweet. We're not bothered about work speed. This guy is just going to be a complete killing machine. There we are. We've done that. And I've used a lot on Blazer Moot. Blazer Moot is going to be my lead when we go into the boss battle again, people. And uh, hopefully we're going to get him totally infused as well. Because, hold on, I'm sure I just made him like a, a, a one... S I'm sure I made him go up a level inside of this thing. Hold on. Okay, let's, let's go back in there then. Let's grab Blazer Moot. He's our main pal. I guess. Ah, okay, yeah, he's gone up one star. We need to get him up to two star now, and that's what I'm doing. I've got all the eggs on the bake. So I'll be back when we get to that stage, people. But his stats are looking a lot better. Well, okay, chums, we are completely out of cake now. So but we've got loads of eggs still on the bake. I've hatched a load. We should be almost in a position where we can infuse a load to at least get our powers up to maybe level two, level three, for the war sect and also the blazer moot and you know what i might just try my luck against the boss and see how we do just to see if there's a larger improvement to see if this is worthwhile because to go them up to the next level you're going to need to have loads i'm going to have to bake loads of cakes i'm going to be at this for days it's it's insane the amount of work that might go into this so let's just keep our fingers crossed and let's just hope we've done enough work people now one of the actual abilities that my war sect has got is Flame Emperor, but he hasn't got a Flame Move. So I'm going to see if I can get some sort of Flame Ability and teach it to it. At least then my War Sect will be able to apply Burn. So let's see, have we got any Flame Fruits here? Yes, Fire Skill. Okay, let's pick that up then. Stick it there. Now if I come out of here, I've never used one of these before, so if I go onto it and press Y maybe? Yeah. And then just put it onto here. Let's see what flame skill he learns. Blair Storm. Yeah, alright. Okay. It didn't let me choose which ability to overwrite. And now I can't actually see it. Mm, okay. Let's go have a look at the old PAL box. There must be, there's probably an easier way of doing it, but it goes really slow. Okay, right. So. Well, I don't see he has learned a flame move there. Um. Right. Party. Let's go choose War Sect for a second then. Aha! So I want to change out maybe the Giga Horn. Yeah? Aha! Oh look, there's Ignis Blast or Flare Storm. Yeah, we're giving Flare Storm. Sweet! Okay. Stone Cannon. I might, ref I might put that one out to Ignis Blast. Might as well, might as well. Yeah, heck yes. Hmm, actually, Stone Cannon looks like it might do more damage. But that one might. Hmm, I don't know whether it does inflict burn. We'll just leave him as he is, I think. Flare Storm is good enough, I think. That's pretty cool. 
It'd be nice if I could give them a, a freeze move at the same time, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah, you can freeze them or burn them. But there we go, we've got that on the way. You know what, I'm, I might just check my other guy, actually. So this guy, what moves has he got on? He's got Fireball. Now, one of his partner skills, he's got an awesome move for the Fire... Oh, OK, Ignis Blast. Power Shot or Ignis Blast. All right, that, that's pretty much what we're gonna, we've got there, then. I think, I think he's already got the best moves already attached to this guy. Now, we've already got him up one level. We can start the infusion. You see what I mean? It's just so slow in those menus. It's really slow. Anyway, there's some more eggs to hatch. But let's go and infuse these two. Let's see what we can do with this one. Okay. Uh, right, so we're going to do the blazer moot first. Let's see if we can get him up a level. And we're going to be putting in the boss blazer moots. I guess we are. And more blazer moots inside of here. I should have sorted my um, PAL deck first. And I'm, here's a load more. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Are we almost there? I think we're going to do it. Sweet! It looks like we've got one left over. Okay, let's do this. Begin condensation. Should have really checked to see if I had a male and female so I can carry on my breeding. Well, there we are. And that's now boosted them to level two. Freaking awesome. Alright, well, let's do my insect guy, war set. And we really need to put four in this time to get them up to level four. Sweet. And I haven't got enough to do 16 yet on the old war set. But we're nearly there. We're nearly there, people. And he's looking pretty darn freaking gnarly anyway. Alright, and we'll go try our luck against this boss. I'm just going to hatch all the rest of these eggs. So I'll probably be back in about another half hour. And I'll let you know if I've got enough to infuse more, but I don't think I will have. I, I will on the um, war set. I will on war set, not on um, blazer moot. Right, well, I figured I'm just going to take on the very first boss, just to, as a test, to see how my blazer moot does. Let's just see how he does against this guy. Okay, melting them pretty darn quickly. I've applied burn, burn damage. This is going to be a record. Come on, Blazer Moon. Do stuff. Also, I figured this would be a good way to level up my war set to level 50. So, let's see how we're going. And I need to do something while we're waiting for the rest of the eggs to hatch. So, there we are. Shoot him in the backside. Nice. Well, my Blazer Moon's damage, I mean, hasn't even registered. There's a freaking tank in it, mate. Well, there we go. Boss eliminated. We've got a little bit of XP there. Yeah, you're dead. Ha, ha, ha. Not enough to get my war set to level 50, though. Interesting. Cool. Right, well, let's, let's head back to base then. I mean, I, I could carry on killing a couple of bosses in my own time, try and get my war set to level 50. Okay, I should have enough to infuse this war set. So let's get it underway. Lovely. And I should have four more. Oh, no. Oh, three. We've just enough to give ourselves a treat. There we go. And begin. Yes. Condension completed. And there we go. So, I think that's about as good as we're going to get for the boss, people. So, we're we'll going to take on the boss. We've got two level 50s, and they're both plus twos. I haven't put any souls into this guy, but this guy's had 14 souls gone into him. So, yeah, I'm hoping that's going to do it. I'm hoping that's going to do it. I've also got this chap who's a boss one. We've also got this guy and that guy that we're going to be taking in. I do, This guy's just so freaking tanky. He's awesome. There's a very late. Yes, anyway. Let's, um, let's go take on the boss then, people. Let's, let's go do this. All right? Okay. I'll see you at the boss. Okay, here we go, chums. Get him, Blazer Moot. Hiya! Right, I need to change my armor quickly. Into this armor. Go. Run like the wind. We need our rocket launcher. Oh no, I went and fired it at a freaking post. Alright, there we go. Come on, Blaze Moot, don't just sit there. You've got work to do, my friend. See so if we can get him in this corner, shall we? Oh, great, you freaking froze me. Kaboom. Reload. Go, Blaze Moot. Freaking heck, yes. Reload. Fire! Now, I don't really want to lose, because it took me ages to make all these missiles. Die! Oh, you 
No, 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 no. Armor is damaged. Armor is damaged. Holy fudge, people. Holy fudge. Reload. Get in, Blaze Moot. You can do it. Oh, no. I'm going to call Blaze Moot back in. I'm going to bring out Warsect. I'm going to let Blaze Moot get some health back. He was on half energy. How? Man. I can't believe my armor's damaged already. Oh no, for fudge's sake! Get out of here! Get out of here! Get out of here! He's targeting me, people. He's targeting me. Okay. Right. Just keep him on me for a minute while we try and sort this out. Keep away, birdie. Oh no! Freaking post in the way! Oh my days, that was almost game over. Is having bat damaged armor worse than having no armor or putting on a weaker set? I don't know. I'm hoping it's doing something. Oh, fudging heck! You know what? Let's just stick on another set of armor just in case. Let's just stick this one on instead. That one says it's damaged as well. For fudge's sake, Stevie. Stick on this one then. Okay. That one says it's damaged. Hold on, I don't think it is my armor that's damaged. It's probably the headpiece or something. I don't know what's going on. We're just going to ignore the armor damaged notification. Ah, you get! Okay, it, the time limit isn't even halfway down. Oh no! Ah, oh, shite! You get back! Ah, man. Ah, man. Take that, you. Okay, reload. Oh, you fudging pigeon of evilness! Take that! Warsax! No! I'm down for the count, people. I'm down for the count. Okay, this time I think my armor let me down, people. My armor let me down. Let's go back to camp and let's find out what the fudge got broken on my armor. Not that I can actually see what it was that's causing the problem. What is it that's broken? It's not the shield. It, it was the headpiece. The headpiece was damaged, people. Ah, oh, man. Okay. All right, fine. Well, it looks like we're, we're still not quite there yet, are we, people? Even though I've... Actually, my pals actually did a lot better. It was me that let the team down this time. Me. Okay, let's go on over here, then. Let's get this fixed, then. Right, I need palladium fragments. All right, fine. Let's get this sorted. And hopefully we go back and take him on again. Okay, chums. Right now, I'm all fully repaired. I say fully repaired. My armor's repaired. My shield's about good. And um, I've, I've repaired this. I haven't repaired these. I don't really use these. They don't do much damage against the boss. I've also got some bits and bobs that I can feed to my um, pals. Let's just put the food into here. And I think we're about good to go up against the boss for a second time okay let's do this people thank you so firstly i need to put on my cold armor why we head on over there all right i'll see you at the boss people i'm just going to keep the cold armor on for now i think because uh i don't want my shield to disappear okay right go get him blaze moot okay let's go get him Reload. If he knocks out my shield, then I'll swap to the other armor. Holy fudge. That done awesome amounts of damage that time. Yes. Okay, cool. Oh, no. I've lost my armor. So now, let's... Uh, the shield, sorry. Let's swap to that armor quickly. Freaking run like the wind. Hold on. Is Blazer Moot dead? Shite. Okay. That was unexpected. I did not expect Blazemoot to go down so quickly. And Warsect is getting battered. Oh my days, what the fudge is going on? Leave him alone, pigeon. No, my Warsect is dead already. I don't know what's going on here, people. But, um, yeah, something seriously has gone wrong. I'm doing some good damage with my rockets, though. 
But my, um... Holy fudge! Oh my days! See what I mean by this little guy? I, I haven't done anything to this little guy. And he's taking some serious freaking punishment. Maybe I should get him up to full freaking stats. I mean, his, his attacks aren't that good. Holy fudge! Oh no! I'm about done. I'm about cooked, people. Freaking heck! I don't know why Blaze Moot did not last the test of time. Sometimes it's just about freaking luck, isn't it? Holy fudge! Uh, it's about freaking luck, isn't it? You know? Oh, the, his attacks are so hard to dodge. I played Elden Ring. And, you, know, you know what? Some of his attacks are harder than the Elden Ring attacks to freaking judge. Keep your eye on him the whole time. Oh no, he's down too! Okay, go on. Holy mackerel! No, 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 no! Oh, I missed my opportunity there to do a really good hit. Yeah, keep freezing him. Nice! Go on! Heck yes, rope. These are the ones I didn't freaking put anything into. I, I've got a good team. Ah! Got him in the face! Go on! Heck yes! I was doing 5,000 damage a little while ago. Now I'm doing 3,000. It must be something diet or something. I must have had some sort of boost. Oh no! Uh oh! Obviously I haven't got that boost anymore. But you know what? The Repto Chris can just keep him occupied just for a little bit longer. Maybe we might do this. This is all down to my 50 bullets. Come on, freaking reload. No! No, he got me! He freaking got me again, people. He got me again. Ah, oh, God. So it does look like I'm going to have to boost the rest of my team. And I don't know what the fudge happened to my uh, Blazer Moot. Blazer Moot should be kicking ass at this rate, but sadly not. Just not, is he? It's just not doing a... Ah, dang it, I'm going to have to make a load of freaking missiles and all sorts. It's going to take me ages to get all my um, powers up to scratch to take him on. I'm going to have to bake a load more cakes. I'm going to have to do a load more infusing. Oh... My days, people. I just don't know whether I've got it in me to be bothered, to be fair. I mean, it's the last boss. I, I do want to be able to take him out. But, God, is it worth it? The grind is seriously crazy. It's through the nines. But, you know, you don't get anything in this world if you don't grind for it, I suppose. You've got to work hard to play hard. And I do seriously enjoy this game. I'm just not enjoying being stuck at this boss for so poxy long. Hold on. My war set is now level 50. I'm going to have to recover these guys. I still have one more pal left as well. If only I could have held my own just that little bit longer. If I could have held it together that bit longer, I think I could have had him that battle. I think I'm very close, people. I might have to just infuse these last three. I might go to town. We'll reconvene next episode. And I might have infused these up and got these up a couple of levels as well, people. All right. Leave it with me. We will beat this game. We will beat this game, people. We will. Heck yes. It's not like I'm in a mad rush. Dragon, I mean, um, Dragon's Dogma 2 doesn't come out until the 22nd of March. So I want to be playing this at least until then. So until then, I, th I think that gives me enough time to beat this game. The 22nd of March. There we are. Anyway, until next time, people. Goodbye, goodbye. And goodbye again.